Well, we're only a few short weeks away from Christmas, but one organization in Brainerd is bringing in the festive holiday a little early, all for a good cause. Clayton Castle has the story. We haven't hit Thanksgiving yet, but Christmas has come early to a house on Gall Lake as the Brainerd chapter of Zonta International is holding its annual Christmas house at the home of Kelly and PJ Smith on Gall Lake. And it's all for a good cause. Our goal and our mission is to empower women around the world. We do that both locally here in the Brainerd area, but our local club also contributes to our international projects. Planning the event is an intricate process, but one that is worth the smiles when people come in and see the festive decorations. We have find a very generous homeowner who will give us their house for a couple days and we invite mo um, small businesses from th throughout the area to decorate rooms, parts of rooms. So we have beautiful decorations. We also have people that sell things. We have vendors. While this is not the first Christmas house that Zonta has put on, it's the first one at the newly built home on Gall Lake. Usually we are in Brainerd or Baxter. So we thought, well, let's try let's try a house on Gall Lake. A little farther out, but we're hoping for many people to come from Nisswa and Pequot Lakes too. The event began tonight and continues tomorrow, and it's not too late to take part in the fun. We sell tickets ahead of time. $10, but tickets are available at the door for $12, and if you come and buy a ticket, Sherwood Forest has been very generous also with letting us use their parking, and they're doing a two-for-one appetizer, so you get a ticket and you get a little deal over at Sherwood Forest, too. The event continues tomorrow from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. here at the house on Gull Lake. Reporting in Nisswa, Clayton Castle, Lakeland News. Other organizations the club works with throughout the year are the Mid-Minnesota Women's Center and the Poor Girls Home. This is the sixth year for the annual Christmas House. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.